Welcome to Observatory Park. We're going to take you on a virtual tour of Phase Two construction progress on October 27th, 2010. The entrance drive we're on now will be paved before the park opens. It's usually breezy at Observatory Park, but on this day, the winds were particularly strong after yesterday's storm. We'll let this gust of wind come up to demonstrate it as we enter the main parking lot and look ahead to the central plaza. You can see the tops of the Oberly Observatory and the public building over the mound, which is there to block headlights from throwing their beams into the central plaza. We'll take a stroll now on the newly poured sidewalk and take a turn into the central plaza, where you will first see the human sundial. Up ahead, the Oberly Observatory is on the left and the public building is on the right. What you cannot tell from this video is that the solar panel array and the green roof are both complete on the public building roof. And now we're approaching the heart of the central plaza. A close look at the front of the public building and its roof, hosting the solar array on the high side and the green roof on the low side. The central plaza will host the lunar phases display and the constellation display. It opens into the 35 acres which will host the Planetary Trail, the Weather Trail, the outline of the Great Pyramid of Giza, and the Henge Display. This is but now we see Oberly Observatory, where the refurbished Oberly Telescope will be housed. The huge tube for the telescope is moved into place on its heavy concrete pedestal just the day before, which we will see in a moment. You get a glance at the retractable roof. As we enter Oberly Observatory, the first person you see is Aaron Young, Planning Department Director. The gentleman in the background is on the Hummel Construction Crew, which is our Phase II contractor from Ravenna. Up on the pedestal is Chris Lynn, Park Planner and the Planning Staff Person assigned as the Point Person for Observatory Park. As you can see, the esoteric components of the telescope are yet to be installed. These are the telescope pads for anyone wishing to bring their own telescopes. Clearly, they can host some serious amateur telescopes. Another good look at the immediately adjacent 35-acre site for the planetary and weather trails, the hinge display, and the outline of the Great Pyramid of Giza, the latter of which will have four cornerstones, each the exact size of those of the actual Great Pyramid. Let's step across the central plaza and enter the public building. The first thing we see is one panel from the planetarium dome. Looking up, we can see the cables, which will suspend the dome. On the roof above those cables is the solar array, providing renewable energy for Observatory Park. As we look to our right, you can see the other panels for the planetarium. Finally, we'll take a step back and get a view of the Phase II construction from a position behind the public building, just about where the renewable energy wind turbine will be. As we conclude, envision the many school buses which will be parked here and the excited students and teachers and chaperones for the many field trips to come.
We hope you enjoyed this virtual tour of the early Phase 2 Observatory Park construction on October 27, 2010.